to the roof now of the van. I have measurements for this roof rack I'm making. I'm gonna triple check them. Lordy dee dungeon. It's kinda of what I've got so far. So I'm just gonna do some other measurements. I just dropped the GoPro off the roof of the van. Doesn't seem too bad. Anyways, we're gonna move the ATV out of the shop and start lining up some of this metal. Right on. I'm gonna cut my two end pieces, which are 58 to the inside 45 inside corner of the 45 and then I'll cut my long pieces so you can cut this aluminum with a miter saw no problem just wear safety glasses <laughs> I hit my truck sorry truck So now I'm going to get the long pieces cut. This is the setup here, how I'm cutting these long ones using a ladder. But it'll work. I know you shouldn't cut like this. I'm too close to the building. I don't feel like moving it. So. Safety first though, don't do this. Idea, William. Okay, that'll be that, like that. Just double check the end. All right, that's it. Now we can go lay it out, and we can start welding. It's all set up here. I'm going to start in this corner, so I've kind of. Got it off the ground. I've got it squared up. Let's see, that's pretty good. Pretty square. This here will hold it square. And then I have just kind of shimmed this up just so it's flush all the way around. Now a little disclaimer. <laughs> I'm not a welder. All right, I'm a plumber. I learned how to stick weld in school, and I wouldn't even say I learned. I, we just did it. It was something. I think just to take up time and, you know, get us out of the classroom. 
I'm a will of all trades, so I'm just gonna do it. I got the machine set up. It's a MIG. You need 100% argon when you're welding aluminum. Best thing to do is get a spool gun, which I have here. I got 4043 in there. I played around with the machine for about two, three hours yesterday, and I came up with all these beautiful welds. Just, just gorgeous welds. Now I have a grinder with a grinding disc to clean up the welds. A stainless steel uh, brush to clean up the aluminum before you weld. This uh, aluminum cost me around a thousand bucks total. So, not bad if I can make it look half decent, right? Let's uh, start practicing and pray to God that it goes, goes well. I gotta show you guys this because I think it's a pretty good, uh, pretty good bead for a, for a newbie. You see that? I think that's pretty good. You can see here, I feel strong, so. I think I'm ready to go. I'm a little nervous. All right, so. Not too bad. Clean that up with the grinder. I'm gonna do this side. I'm gonna let you guys watch. Pretty happy with how square that is. Make sure you got a good ground on your piece. how I started so clean up all that scuff so we're gonna move on get those other two done and uh, I'll show you what it looks like when it's all said and done I've got all my corners all welded up there she be by so I'm going to weld now this vertical joint so that I can kind of maneuver it around a little bit better without any issues I, I will have to lift it up onto the van here once uh, Danny gets here, so just gonna finish up those welds. I see he's got the roof rack up there, looking good. It looks super good. I'm I'm happy that Will got so much done. Well, here it is. And now we're just gonna practice with Danny. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Whoa, baby. I have a need for speed. Baby, you see how you're going so fast? Yeah, you're not allowing the met the wire to melt into the metal. It's so gonna. Is that what's happening to me? The wire is melting into the metal. That's called welding. That's baby, how you weld. I didn't know what I was doing. I didn't know how it worked. I was wondering how it worked. Dad has not enough wire in it. It's going weld, 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 and it's not Yo, going. That looks kind of sick, though. Well, you're an artist. That looks like a sweet abstract piece. Yeah, I'm gonna eat a chip. Look at that. Does it look okay? It looks beautiful. Yay! You did a great job. Thanks. Now we're gonna try to weld this corner piece. Ready? Welded my. <laughs> Why did I weld? Nothing. Your foot? 
See how it didn't so touch this one? So I was too far over. You started off really good, then you went too fast. Yeah. No, I didn't go too fast, I think. No, you did go too fast. I was oh. watching you. Keep your distance good. Your tip can be a little closer. Yeah, right there. Beautiful. Beautiful. That's good, Bob. I did it! That's good. I kind of did it. Like, there's these two sides I didn't quite get to. That's one for the books. That's fun, though. That's so good. Start in the center and just kind of pull it like little circles. Yeah. Good. Good. My side looks okay. It's pretty good. Your side a little short still. Pretty good though. Getting the hang of it, eh? Yeah. Okay, we're done for the day. Time to clean up shop. Let's do it. Let's do it. D left a mess in here. <laughs> Tools everywhere. Boy! Come on, baby! Okay. Felt like a bullet, he was gone again. Cause I was thinking about a little white tank top sitting right there in the middle by me.